Tens of thousands of Hindu minorities rallied in Bangladesh, demanding protection from escalating attacks. Hindu leaders are also urging the government to drop sedition charges against prominent Hindu activists. Around 30,000 Hindus gathered in Chhattogram city centre, chanting slogans and calling for rights and protection. Police and soldiers were stationed to monitor the rally and similar demonstrations were also reported from various places across Bangladesh. Since early August, Hindu groups report over 2,000 attacks, largely following the ouster of secular leader and former Bangladesh Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina after a student-led uprising. Nobel laureate and interim government head Mohammad Yunus claims these figures are exaggerated. The Bangladesh Hindu Buddhist Christian Unity Council, a key minority group, says the government has failed to ensure their safety. Hindu leaders have organized rallies since August, pressing for measures such as a law for minority protection, a dedicated ministry and a tribunal to address violence against minorities. They also seek an extended holiday for their major festival, Durga Puja. Friday's protest in Chhattogram followed sedition charges filed against 19 Hindu leaders, including priest Chandan Kumar Dhar, due to an October 25 rally incident involving a saffron flag being raised near the national flag. The Hindu community argues these cases are politically motivated and demands their withdrawal within 72 hours. Another rally is planned in Dhaka for Saturday. Beyond the Hindu protests, supporters of Hasina's Awami League and Ali Jatiyo Party also report harassment post Hasina's ouster. On Thursday night, Jatiya's headquarters was vandalized and set on fire. Despite threats, Jatiya Party chairman GM Kadar stated that his party will continue to protest. They announced a Saturday rally to address price hikes and charges against members. However, Dhaka Metropolitan Police later banned gatherings near Jatiya's headquarters, prompting Jatiya leaders to postpone the rally in compliance with police orders.